People always talk about how efficient are internal combustion engine cars? How much fuel does your car use? Is it better and more fuel efficient than the last model? But a lot of people aren't aware of the fact that electric cars have different efficiency depending upon how they're made. Here are the 10 most fuel efficient or electricity efficient electric cars that you can buy in the United States. Hello my friends and welcome to the Electric Viking. Great to have you here on the channel. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Welcome back, everyone else. Potentially my favorite writer, Steve Hanley writes for Clean Technica that back in the golden age of cars in America, which was around 1967 in his opinion, the magic numbers everyone talked about were cubic inches and horsepower. In today's world of electric cars, the most important metric is efficiency. An efficient EV can drive further on a given amount of electricity, which can translate into smaller, less expensive batteries or longer range between charging sessions. So it's a big plus if you have a more efficient electric vehicle. It makes a lot of sense, right? The reason efficiency is so important in electric cars is because gasoline packs so much energy into every gallon. It matters little if some of it, or even a lot of it, gets wasted. In comparison, even the best batteries in electric cars today have a much lower energy density. That said, I should point out the fact that electricity is much more efficient than burning fossil fuels or burning gasoline or petrol. In fact, the efficiency of most gasoline cars is around about 20%, whereas electric cars are over 90%. However, looking at it this way, the 24 kilowatt hour battery in a first generation Nissan Leaf had the same amount of energy as a single gallon of gasoline. The Leaf needed to be more efficient than a similar gas powered car if it was going to be able to travel any significant distance. There are various ways of measuring efficiency, but for drivers in the US, the standard has become how many kilowatt hours of electricity it takes to drive 100 miles, which is about 160 kilometers. Cars.com recently did a survey of the most efficient electric cars you can buy in the US based on that metric. And the results are here. If your favorite EV is not listed here, that's because it wasn't as efficient as these EVs. The most efficient electric cars in the US are number one, the Tesla Model 3 rear-wheel drive. Its energy use per 100 miles is 25 kilowatt hours, and its combined efficiency is 132 miles per gallon. It costs 46,000 US dollars in the United States. Number two is the 2022 Lucid Air Grand Touring with 19 inch wheels. By the way, if you're buying an electric car, you probably don't want big wheels. They make your car less efficient. That vehicle comes with a combined efficiency of 131 miles per gallon, and its energy use is 100 miles per 26 kilowatt hours. However, it does cost 140,000 US dollars, even more than the Tesla Model S Plaid. Number three, the 2022 Chevrolet Bolt, which um, you can't buy. But anyway, energy use per 100 miles is 28 kilowatt hours. Combined efficiency is 120 miles per gallon, and the price is 32,500 US dollars. Number four is the 2022 Hyundai Kona EV, which used to be the king of efficiency. As you can see, it is no longer. Energy use per 100 miles is 28 kilowatt hours. Its combined efficiency is 120 miles per gallon, and it costs 35,000 US dollars. Number five is the Tesla Model S, which uses 28 kilowatt hours per 100 miles. Its combined efficiency is 120 miles per gallon, and it costs 96,000 US dollars. Number six is the 2022 Tesla Model Y Long Range, which has energy use of 28 kilowatt hours per 100 miles, and its combined efficiency is 122 miles per gallon. Its price is 60,000 US dollars in the US. Number seven is the 2022 Chevrolet Bolt EUV. Its energy use per 100 miles is 29 kilowatt, and its combined efficiency is 115 miles per gallon. It's priced at 34,500 US dollars, which makes it a bit of a bargain if you can get your hands on one. Number eight, the 2022 Kia EV6 rear wheel drive. Its energy use is 29 kilowatt hours per 100 miles, 
and its combined efficiency is 117 miles per gallon. Its price is 42,000 US dollars. By the way, it also did just win electric car of the year. Number nine, the 2022 Hyundai Ioniq 5 rear wheel drive. Energy use per 100 miles is 30 kilowatt hours and its combined efficiency is 114 miles per gallon. It costs 45,000 US dollars. Number 10 is the 2022 Kia Niro EV. Its energy use per 100 miles is 30 kilowatt hours and its combined efficiency is 112 miles per gallon. The takeaway, says Steve Hanley, is that there are a number of factors that may make one electric car more suitable for a particular buyer than another. So this isn't the be all and end all when it comes to considering which car you're gonna buy. Styling is important, size is important, safety is important, driver assist technology is important, can it update over the air? Does it have the features you want? Does it have the size you want? These are probably just as important priorities for many people, especially people with kids. Now, Steve says that he read about a couple who rejected a certain EV because it did not have elbow room for two adults in the rear seat when their child seat was installed. That's probably pretty common for most cars, I'd say. Efficiency may not be at the top of your list when you're considering buying an electric car, but it's definitely worth considering. But it's a really handy metric for actually comparing one electric car against another. And it correlates to how far you can drive on a full charge and how often you will need to stop at a charging point while you're on a trip. If batteries had the same energy density as gasoline, none of this would actually matter. We could all drive 97 miles an hour in sub-freezing temperatures and never give a thought to how efficient a car is. But batteries aren't quite there yet. Well, not even close. And so driving electric cars requires some adjustments to our normally lead foot waves. Well, some of us more so than others. Now, interestingly, all of these cars here are either from a Korean automaker or a US automaker. We've got Hyundai, Kia, General Motors, and Tesla. And of course, Lucid as well. Now, I should point out the fact that by virtue of the way they operate, electric cars are actually way more efficient than petrol cars or gasoline powered cars. But of course, the energy density of petrol or gas is far more dense than the energy density in batteries. However, it's predicted that over the next five years, battery energy density will increase by approximately 50%. By which point, people probably won't be as concerned about the efficiency of their electric cars. And they'll also be a lot cheaper. And that is the takeaway here. As energy density continues to improve and move further towards the energy density of a litre of fuel or a gallon of fuel, we're going to see prices continue to come down. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again on the next one. Bye-bye.